We need a Doctor Who animated series, and after hearing these three concepts, you might think the same. Last year, Russell T Davies, former showrunner, said Doctor Who would rock a cinematic universe, and oh, now he's the showrunner of the entire show again! Coincidence? <laughs> no way. And with cartoons being a big part of cinematic universes recently, I don't think it's too far to suggest an animated series could be on the cards at last. But what would even qualify for a Doctor Who animated show? Well, here's three concepts I would love to see. Doctor Who The Animated Adventures If you want an animated series that could go on for a long time, I have got the answer. After the missing episode animations got cancelled, no! I've been looking for ways we could experience them again. Hear me out, with so many cartoon shows revamping and even covering similar stories with a quirky twist, I think this would really work for Doctor Who. What if starting from an unearthly child, we got to see the classic series reanimated and retold for a new audience? And it could even have brand new stories with a story arc woven throughout. And I think the original Doctor Who characters could really work as cartoon icons. Does anyone else not just think that would be so cool? The Paternoster Gang. Okay, you saw this one coming, but there is a reason it's a popular choice for a spin-off. Madame Vastra, Jenny and Strax are memorable and interesting characters, and they even have backstories. Not to mention the setting of Victorian London is more than worthy for a TV series. It really is a no-brainer. They were made for a cartoon show. Look at them! Plus, duos and trios are pretty popular in animated series. Each episode of the series could build more of the characters' stories. Maybe Strax has family. Why did Vastra visit Victorian London? And where's the other Silurians? Not to mention, this trio could definitely have an arch enemy trying to bring down their secret organisation. The Doctor Who Adventures magazine have already provided some of the stories they could base the series around. Plus, the Doctor could easily make appearances for big events. I really don't know why they haven't done it sooner. Fugitive. One of the biggest missed opportunities of the Whitaker era is the underuse of Jo Martin's Doctor. At this point, the least they could do is give her a series. This is the perfect excuse to have a series set on Gallifrey, and then we can find out what the heck happened! Show me the rest. I'm not sure you can cope with much. Show me the rest! Even if it's explained in the last special, that's not enough time to flesh out Lee, the fugitive's entire backstory and Gallifrey history. Chibnall, you've run out of time. So, why not animate it? Imagine a series starting with Joe's doctor being unhappy at Gallifrey and planning on leaving, and then at the very end she's successful after finding out shocking secrets of Gallifrey. And that's only the start. What about how she lost her memory? Her real planet? GAT! So many possibilities. So, could it work? <laughs> yes! They've already animated missing episodes. They've already animated new storylines. There's definitely interest for one. Locations aren't restricted. And it's cheaper! BBC, what are you waiting for? What do you think would work as an animated series? Do you want one as badly as I do? Let me know in the comments. For more videos like this one, feel free to click the red button down below to join the adventure. I've been Christopher, and you've been... Brilliant! Crazy passion and we wanted you to know So are you sitting comfortably? Our tribute to the show is If we had to choose another, we just wanna know